Social media has been buzzing all day with notifications about the big matchups that are set for tonight. I cannot wait for this event. Yeah, guys, I'm not sure what it is, but there's something in the air. It feels like it might be one of those nights that changes everything the here in WWE. Backstage, Corey, has been growing with every... Tell you what, Michael, I'm not going to lie. These two make an awesome tag team. I cannot wait for this match. Adam Cole is here with one thought in mind to shock the system. One of the young guns in NXT. Very impressive lately. His partner is just itching to get in there right about now. The Damn. beauty of tag team competition is that he doesn't need to take the entire brunt of the opposition's attack. Though the thought of making a tag doesn't necessarily appear to be on his mind right now. Well, this certainly escalated in a hurry. I don't think any of us expected to see him fall behind so quickly. So sure he had it fully locked in. to go when you're stuck in the fireman's carry. Yeah, down. And I can tell you it's not a pleasant trip. Now look at this aggression, just oh, pure brutality. Come on, easy. Just around like a rag doll. He's starting to stumble here. 
This tag team match can get out of hand quickly because of Mountain Offense soon. It looks to me like he's really trying to carry this team on his back, which really isn't necessary considering he has a very capable partner he can tag in here. He seem more motivated than ever heading into this match, which makes me think he still has plenty of fight left in him. There's a tag. Double team maneuver on the horizon. For many years, members of the WWE Universe and the WWE Locker Room have felt that tag team matches should have two referees. One referee is in the ring overseeing the action, and the other is located out on the floor, making sure teams follow the rules and do not engage in potentially damaging behavior. I think it's a good idea, something perhaps Mr. McMahon... No trouble getting out of that one. Yeah, it's going to take more than that. Byron, earlier you raised a point that people have been talking about for years, and that's a second referee being a point. You only got one. Make the last shot count. But did he go for it too early? Harper's chances just went from bad to worse. This might be it. Oh, my. This could end it in a hurry. Oh, that's the impact. I knew it was only a matter of time. Huh? He goes for the cover. And he breaks the pin. Right on the wrong way down. back in this match guys he looks rested and ready to go to me Boom. when this guy's on look out attack to the midsection power slam he's looking a little off balance this very well may be too much for him to handle striking at will this could be it Wrapped out a two count he's not giving up that easy Rowan, big move coming up. Oh, Riley right. just barely getting out of the way. Oh, boy, he is warm. Escapes trouble there. Oh, impact. Gets the tag. Yet another counter. It's like they're both somehow one step ahead of each other. Oh, brain buster! That's how you put an exclamation point on a match. And the odds just swung in Kyle O'Reilly's favor. Tag team scene here in WWE is undergoing a bit of a renaissance, and it's because of action like this. A leverage pin here. Hey, it's only 
cheating if you get caught. True testament to grit. How'd he do that? Extremely confident. Well, it's not dire consequences for him here, which is good. But just in case, he might want to think about getting his partner in there for a bit. Hey, his opponent has a pulse. Who knew? For a while there, I thought he was in there with a tackle dummy. He's got him covered. The referee didn't blow that call. Wow, that's pure power, guys. He gets it with a reversal. Oh, high impact. Another great tag team match here tonight. I don't think the tag team scene has ever been hotter here in WWE. Tagged in. Oh, nasty impact. Beautiful technique. Oh, my goodness, this hurts. Oh. He's making a statement here with this attack. A lot of people are questioning how this superstar got such a favorable spot in this week's power rankings. But not to me. It seems perfectly logical. of tag team victory. Some superstars doing what they do best. Here are the highlights. Look at him go. He's getting after it here. This was another great moment. And this is how he ended it. Here are your winners, Adam Cole and Kyle O'Reilly, the Undisputed Era. 
Big win here to start the show. These two work so well together, Michael. I'd be surprised if they went their separate ways anytime soon. Believe it or not, that's just the beginning, folks. Stay tuned for more great action. Johnny Gargano is becoming the WWE's most cherished underdog. Look for Johnny Wrestling to put out another great performance tonight. These guys are undoubtedly going to give us a show here tonight. Johnny Wrestling is hoping to show his opposition just how he earned that nickname. Oh, Byron, you see, some people named John use Johnny instead. Well, you meant the wrestling part. Too soon. Wicked close on. Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Elbow drop with authority. Boom, what impact. His shoulders are down. Johnny Gargano forces the shoulder up. And the match continues. He's taking some offense. He looks to be a little surprised right now. I wouldn't call for the medics just yet, Cole. He still appears to be in pretty good shape here. Ouch. What a strike. Taking off his feet here. And it's moves like that that make him so dangerous. This power. What an inverted DDT. Going for the cover. And Davari pops the shoulder up. Clearly not enough damage done. Schultz I hate you. He's on the defensive now. He'll need to find a way to turn things around here. Oh, man. His chances are dwindling quickly. He's just taking on so much punishment. Yeah, he's clearly not on the right side of this match right now, which is a little surprising to me. Back in the ring again. What a stop. Enough already. Oh. 
gets out of the way of that one. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Oh, long dart into the turnbuckle. Nobody does it quite like him. Cole, I don't think people realize how much strength... He's got some fight left in him. Not yet. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Just ended this. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar work his soul ever does. Oh man, that hurt. You have to wonder what's going through these guys' minds in a match of this magnitude. For the arm. When this guy's on, look out. Gargano hooks it up. Full Nelson slam. The cover. And this one's history. What a win. Now let's take a look back at some of the great action. Man, this was great. And I always enjoy watching him perform. Here is your winner, Johnny Gargano. Kicking off the night with an impressive victory. Yeah, the performance put forth in that match tells me we're looking at somebody who will someday, very soon, be competing in the main event. Plenty more action still to come here tonight, folks. You can feel the electricity running through this arena. This is going to be some battle. One-on-one. -on -one, mano a mano. I don't know who's looking more forward to this. The women in the ring or me? Not a lot of people can break out of that one, Michael. She goes for the cover. Shayna Baszler, no problem getting out. Just not enough damage done yet, Cole. Beautiful technique. Boom, knee right to the 
face. She's on the defensive now. She doesn't want to let this get out of control, guys. It looks to me, guys, like she may have underestimated her opponent here tonight, and now she's paying for it. This might be one of the most tightly contested matches I've seen in a long time. Any one of these women can win this thing. Oh, oh man! If you ask a member of the WWE Universe about the four horsewomen, they likely refer to the quartet of Charlotte, Bailey, Sasha Banks, and Becky Lynch. However, there's another group that lays claim to that moniker, and it includes Ronda Rousey and Shayna Baszler. Yeah, both groups actually met face-to-face -face at the Mae Young Classic. Ronda Rousey, Jessamyn Duke, and Marina Shafir were there to root on Shayna Baszler, and they met with WWE's group. Rousey told them, quote, you name the time, you name the two of you brought up the collision between WWE's and MMA's four horsewomen, courtesy of Shayna Baszler. At the time since that showdown, Ronda Rousey has joined WWE, while the other two MMA horsewomen have begun Shayna Baszler making her moves. Oh man, she's rolling now. She's not in very good shape at all right now. She may very well have reached the point of no return. Yeah, but we all know harsh impact. That has got And Shayna Baszler tries the early cover. That's it. The match is over. Corey, I think that may be the biggest win. It's hard not to agree with you, Cole. It was an incredible victory. Yeah, I mean, a hard-fought matchup. And that's a great show of respect. Tremendous sportsmanship. Gotta love it. as we kick off this tag team match. These superstars are about to put on a clinic in tag team competition, guys. That's how good they are. Ziggler is here to show the world just how good he is, and he's ready to steal the show. Yeah, well, it's that attitude that gives him the moniker of the show off, but you've got to respect the guy who isn't afraid to lay it all on the line and bet on himself. Bad spot for him to be in here, guys. He's got to do something to get back in this thing. Ooh, nasty impact. Inside the ring now. He's not in a good spot here, guys. He simply needs to find a way to regroup. This might be it! Oh, my! In May of 2017, SmackDown Live saw an incredible women's tag team match when Charlotte Flair and Becky Lynch squared off against welcoming committee members Natalya and Carmella. The rivalry between these women got so intense that Naomi was in Flair and Lynch's corner and Tamina was in Natalya and Carmella's corner. I think only a group as treacherous as the welcoming committee could bring Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair back together. Natalya's power set the tone for the match and gave her team an advantage. That was until Carmella's overconfidence let the Irish last kicker turn the tide and get back into the match. And then it was elementary from there for the Irish-born superstar. Naomi did an excellent job of making sure any quote-unquote committee nonsense cost her girls the match. 
Once Becky Lynch got Carmella locked in the disarmor, there was nothing for the Staten Island Princess to do but to tap out. And it didn't take long for that to happen. If you recall, guys, when Drew McIntyre first showed up here in 2009, he was anointed the Chosen One. And while it may have been premature back then, I'd say McIntyre is more than living up to it nowadays. There may be no escaping this fireman's carry. I don't know. Never say never, Cole. As Byron alluded to, Drew McIntyre's initial run in WWE had ups and downs, but ever since his return in 2017, I'd say McIntyre's among the most dominant superstars on the roster. As would the people he's defeated since returning. And let's look at some of these names, Cole. Bobby Roode, Andrade Cien Alma, Seth Rollins. Those are some pretty big names, if you ask me. Team history was made when the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions were crowned at Backlash 2016. The unlikely duo of Rhino and Heath Slater caught lightning in a bottle and ran through the Tag Team Title Tournament. In the finals, Rhino and Slater took on the Usos to see which team would be the inaugural Tag Team Champions. And what a reversal from Drew McIntyre. There was a lot on the line in the Tag Team Tournament Finals. The Usos wanted to add another Tag Team title reign to their resume and enjoyed the recognition of being the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions. The team of Rhino and Heath Slater was the team no one expected to be in the Finals. Slater had extra motivation because he was fighting for a WWE contract. And at one point, it seemed like the Usos had everything well in hand, but Rhino and Heath Slater refused to lose. After a gore from Rhino practically cut Jimmy Uso in half, Rhino and Heath Slater went from an unlikely tag team to the first ever SmackDown Tag Team Champions. Never say never in WWE is absolutely right. In a tag team contest, a superstar and partner locked up against another duo. Unless there's a special stipulation added to the match, the traditional rules of a singles match apply in terms of winning the match via pinfall, submission, countout, or disqualification. In a standard tag team match, one competitor is in the ring against an opponent, and their teammate is in their corner standing on the ring apron. I should also point out that the competitor in the ring, as far as the referee is concerned, is the legal man. Only the legal man can attempt to score a fall over an opponent, or be defeated by an opponent. In a tag match, when a superstar tags their partner, the person who tagged out has until the referee's count of five to exit the ring. For a tag to be considered legal, both of the superstar's feet have to be on the apron. The partner must be touching the tag rope in the corner. Both team members must touch, and the referee must see the tag be made. I say Drew McIntyre's career is a story of two completely different chapters. McIntyre himself would tell you his first chapter didn't quite go as planned, but boy, chapter two is a whole nother story. Sit out, pile driver. Almost there, and he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. Nice half kick, great elevation. Michael, I like your analogy of McIntyre's career as two different chapters. And while chapter one didn't necessarily blow anybody away, there was a foreshadowing of his future success. Oh, even Mr. McMahon himself called McIntyre a future world champion, which of course later came true in 2017 when McIntyre defeated Bobby Roode for the NXT Championship. starting to stagger a bit, and you have to assume his partner is just itching to get in there right about now. The good news for him is that his opponent's offense is likely packing a little less of a punch, considering all the damage he was able to inflict earlier in this match. Nobody can lose the pace of a match quite like this guy. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Tying up the legs now. Oh, look at the surfboard! Uh, oh, continuing to punish them! Oh, stop in the leg! What's nasty? Uh-oh, wheelbarrow into a... Oh, man! 
Good night. I'm not sure how much. And Eric Young makes the cover. Two, two, three. They did it. Wow, what a match. Now let's get another look at some of the high points of that one. He ain't playing here. He ain't messing around. And last but not least, there was this. of what to expect here tonight we are in for an amazing evening i wouldn't be surprised if we saw these teams going back to it at some point in the very near future This should be an incredible matchup. I mean, both men have extensive offensive repertoires, lasting endurance, and an insatiable appetite to be number one. Settle in, guys. This is going to be a blast to watch. Oh, what impact. Drop down. here he's gonna need to find a way to fire back yeah he's taking on some offense here but that's to be expected his shoulders on the mat he's a long way from a three count i can tell you that he's got some more fight in him guys Joe looking a little startled right now. 
With these two guys, we all knew this was going to be an all-out battle. Oh. Well, he had to expect to take some punishment tonight. You don't step in the ring with this guy and walk away completely unscathed. Oh, and he connects. There's no reason to lose your footing on a move like that. Come on, toughen up. Samoa Joe. The Destroyer still has destruction to dish out. That is a frightening thought. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Ooh, what impact. Bang! Bang! So quick. Harsh impact. Oh boy, he is rolling. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his salt ever does. Uh-oh, double underhook. This is going to be nasty. There it is. That is a game changer. He needs to capitalize on it. Digging deep for a kick out. Just power out. can't get over the physicality of this match. It's been absolutely brutal. Absorbing a little bit of punishment here. Nothing to be overly concerned about, though. This is going to be big, one way or another. Looking for the finish. He wants no part of this. Incoming. Nailed it. In some trouble here now for Samoa Joe. This is not where he wants to be at this point in this match. If you're this superstar, you gotta be happy about where you're listed in the recent power rankings. Beautiful technique. Into the buckle. Roll through. The shoulders are down. And he got a near fall out of it. The destroyer still has destruction to dish out. That was a frightening thought. A lot of people are questioning how this superstar got such a favorable spot in this week's power rankings. But not to me. Seems perfectly logical. Looks like he's starting to falter. This may very well be one of his toughest challenges in a very long time. He's really starting to look fatigued here, guys. And when that happens, your whole body starts to give out on you. He's going to need to be careful here. He's looked great up until now, and it's imperative that he doesn't lose focus and let his opponent back into this match. Joe is rolling, and he doesn't have an answer for him. Big slam. If that doesn't end it, I don't know what will. Here's a cover. Could be it. Two. And he gets the shoulder up. Uh-uh. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Determination, Cole. Oh, what incredible power. Wow, what a vertical suplex. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Oh, he's such a tough target.
We know what's coming here. Oh, what impact. This one's over, guys. This may very well be it. And he got a near fall out of it. Wow, even when he's in bad shape, Samoa Joe has the strength to power out. There's one. He does. This third. At some point, the referee may want to think about stopping this before somebody gets seriously injured. That's how you wear down your opponent. Oh my goodness, this hurts! Oh! He's making a statement here with this attack. He wants it one more time. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Here we go for the win! The intensity of this match has been incredible. Nasty impact. That should do it. Will it be? Two. Oh, how resilient was that? The Destroyer still has destruction to dish out. That is a frightening thought. A minor miracle might be needed to overcome this beating. Oh, superstar top rope. Oh, no. Lift him up. Here it comes. Do it. Right across the back of the neck. Just when you thought he had nothing left. Samoa Joe speaking his mind. These guys feel no love for each other. Here's another look. Who could forget this? He's getting it done here. Here is your winner, Rush. And that's a win to start off the night. And you just know the rest of the card is watching in the back, wondering how in the world they're going to follow that. What a way to kick off the night. Don't go anywhere, folks. We're just getting started.